Whether therefore ye eat or drink, or whatsoever ye do, do all to the glory of God. Our goal is to serve the Lord and bring glory to Him. Whatever we do, it should be to bring glory to God. Bolivia is a landlocked country located in South America. It borders Brazil, Paraguay, Argentina, Chile, and Peru. Bolivia has lost land to each of these surrounding countries over the years. The west half of the country is mostly made up of the Andes Mountains. In between the Andes Mountain chain is the Altiplano, a high plateau where almost half of the population lives. In the east and north of the country, the land flattens into lowland areas. This region is made up of open grasslands, wetlands, and dense forests, including the world's largest rainforest, the Amazon. Bolivia has an estimated population of 11.3 million souls. Spanish is the main language spoken. Bolivia has two capital cities, Sucre and La Paz. During the Spanish colonization, which started in 1524, Roman Catholicism was imposed on the indigenous people. During the era, indigenous groups blended their own beliefs with Catholicism. Today, Bolivia's constitution grants freedom of religion to all and prohibits religious discrimination. Like everywhere in the world, Bolivia as people that have not been reached yet with the gospel. This is our goal here on this earth, to reach the lost. Hi, my name is Taylor. This is my wife Caitlin and the two boys that God has blessed us with, Jace and Ronan. We are the Fultz family. We are with Baptist Pioneer Missions out of Fundamental Baptist Church in Kinross, Michigan. Our sending church and the church where I grew up in is Lighthouse Baptist Church located in Hessel, Michigan. We believe that God has called our family to the mission field in Bolivia, South America. There are many ministries in the surrounding areas adjacent to where we will be ministering. The Lord, through the work of other missionaries already in the areas, has started churches, a Bible institute, a camp, an orphanage, and various other ministries. While we will and intend to be part of many different ministry opportunities in this area, we are seeking to serve the Lord at the Orphanage of Casa Mia. We desire God's will in our lives and the lives of these children. We will be co-administrators in the Orphanage of Casa Mia. Casa Mia is nestled in the village of Postra Valley, which means Last Valley, up in the Andes Mountains. It is a five to eight hour drive from Santa Cruz to Poster Valley and about 116 miles. Bolivian roads are terrible and the roads to Poster Valley are no exception. Once there, you will find a small town and beautiful mountains surrounding it. The orphanage can house about 23 children 
ranging from ages 4 to 18, or graduating age. The orphanage of Casa Mia started in 1994 and was officially established in 2017. Many of these children come from terrible situations, but we as Christians know that God cares and has a plan for each one of them. Our desire is that these children all surrender their lives to God and grow in Christ, striving to live for Him and bring Him glory. Why Bolivia? Every Christian is called to be a witness, here in your town and church, or across the world. Whenever or wherever God has placed a burden, you and I must be faithful and obey when the Spirit prompts and moves us. Why Casa Mia? There are many ways in which we can serve God and many outreaches. Casa Mia is just one of these ways. It is a command from God to minister to children without mothers and fathers. This has just been a specific desire God has put in our hearts and we hope he puts in yours also. We ask that you remember the children from the orphanage of Casa Mia and keep them in your prayers on a regular basis. We ask that you would also remember our family in prayer as we strive to share the gospel with the lost and aid in church planting and specifically minister in Casa Mia, all for the glory of God.